Okay, now we will look at second baseman in iron. First, we will look at best defense. Mark Lemke. Lemke? Lemke? Really good defense, except infield air. Infield air is not good. And it's really important. So we're using him right now. We might have to switch him out for this reason. We'd also like a little more run speed. Um, especially on our second baseman at shortstop. Um, you can have speedsters in the outfield as well, but it's nice to have them in the middle infield positions. Mark Limka is an 8.6 bat rating. Next we have Jamie Carroll. Jamie Carroll is a 7.6 bat rating but his defense is much more solid across the board. And hey, he can play the pitcher position. He can't pitch, but he can play the pitcher position. Next we have Chris Burke, who is an amazing defender for iron, but his bat is horrible. He is a 4.8. But he's fast, so, I mean, you could use him as a pinch runner. He has some utility there. Then we have Ronald Torres. Torres. Real solid defense. Not great turn double play, but the infield airs. Yeah. His bat rating is an 8.7. He might be replacing Mark Lemka. We'd like a little more speed, but we can find speed elsewhere. Okay, next for bat rating. Marty Barrett. Where'd he go? Amazing avoid case. Not great defense, kind of middling. But his bat rating is an 11. Next we have Mike Mordecai. Middling defense. His bat rating is a 9.8. He's real slow, though. Bill Wamsgans? Wamsagans? How do you say that name? <laughs> Not great defense. His infield arm is atrocious. But his bat is a 9.6. He's got a little bit of speed. Great sacrifice butt, which is not entirely irrelevant. Kevin Kramer. Kevin Kramer is a 9.5. Bill was a 9.6. Better defense. Not great at the position. I'm. Yeah. How does this happen, but then this happens? Not sure about that. He's quick. Not fast, but he's quick. Okay, now power hitters. Don Zimmer. You got that power, you got some speed. Not great with the eye and discipline and the avoid case. Defensive middling. His bat rating is 7.6 because he's hurting right here. But he's got that home run power, especially against righties. Next we have Drew Robinson.
Decent defense. Decent speed. He is a nine. If this was better, he'd be a real contender. So, as far as the overall, we have been playing Mark Lemke. But I think I might be switching him out for Ronald Torres. Another possible contender we haven't talked about yet is uh, where'd he go? He's not here. Tyler Wade. He's just sort of solid everywhere. He is uh, 8.7. Hmm. He's got the speed. What about... I'm going to have to go back and forth between Ronald and Tyler. Tyler looks better. But, oh, that infield air. How much do I value the infield air? They got the same bat rating. I think I'm going to go Tyler Wade, actually. He's still got a good infield air. Yeah, I think, I, think, I think Tyler Wade's the way to go. Okay, we'll come back with uh, third base. 